The first language anyone ever learns is body language. This is why when you cut me off on I-35 and I risk my life and the lives of those around me to take both hands off the steering wheel to give you two whole-ass, well-manicured, excellently executed middle fingers, you know exactly what I'm trying to tell you. See, it's not just in the fingers. The rage. It's in my eyes, my scowl, the bulging blood vessel in my neck. This comforts me. Because I know this asshole knows they piss me off. This is effective communicating. Body language is amazing. Because because without actually saying anything, I've said so much, let's assume that he couldn't hear her. Probably because as soon as he perceived something, he started shouting at the top of his lungs. Let's assume that he couldn't see her very well. That can sometimes happen when you're shining a bright light into a dark room. Let's assume that he has, in fact, met other human beings before. According to state requirements, he had to be at least 19 to apply to be an officer. That means 19 years of presumably seeing and communicating with other humans. Let's remember the start of this poem. The first language anyone ever learns is body language. Now, I would imagine that the body language of someone in their home, minding their own fucking business, suddenly seeing bright lights and hearing shouting at 2 o'clock in the morning may not be the most welcoming of body languages, but there is a definite difference between a body communicating an intent to harm and one just, you know, chilling. Playing video games, being black in their own fucking house. Fun fact, it takes me two seconds to form two well-crafted middle fingers, or one if I really believe in myself and my cause. A testament less to my dexterity and more to the human body being an amazing thing. Able to communicate in a variety of expressive ways, a lot can be said in two seconds without saying anything. Like how in two seconds, this officer decided his prejudice should take precedence from responding to a neighborly welfare check, communicating with weapon drawing and shouting rather than literally any of the training he presumably went through to respond to a non-emergency call. Two seconds. The human body can do incredible things, but communicating its validity for existing in less time than it takes a white officer to scream, show me your hands, shouldn't need to be one of them. See, it's not just in the fingers, the rage. It's in my bloodstream. It's in my newsfeed. It's an entire community paying taxes to be labeled targets in our own spaces of existing fun fact. The human eye can physiologically detect up to 1,000 frames per second, can process an image scene in just 13 milliseconds, can see objects moving at speeds up to 550 miles per hour. I wonder how fast a Tatiana Jefferson would have had to have been moving for this officer to have seen her as a human being, worthy of just a little bit more of his time. The first language anyone ever learns is body language. Fun fact about bodies. When used to effectively communicate, they become movements, tempests, a conglomerate of unified voices with one motivation, justice.